Okay, now the most exciting part of the whole uh, year for Siler is the launching of the new plasma light source. Uh, we're the first company to come out with the new plasma. Uh, we know LED uh, very well. It's a big marketing uh, kind of light source at this point, and it has some beautiful and great advantages, but some uh, you know disadvantages as well. Um, we are coming out with our new LED. We'll have our LED in uh, probably about three months. Uh, but what I really wanted to talk about today was our new plasma. Uh, the plasma light source uh, is going to be about a 6,500 uh, Kelvin temperature. Uh, one of the most beautiful parts of the plasma is that it lasts for about 10 to 15,000 hours. So it has the longevity of almost an LED, but it has the strength of a xenon light source. Uh, xenon has, of course, been kind of the gold standard in uh, lighting in not only microscopy, but almost every other field uh, in the world. And uh, with the plasma, it's going to eventually kind of revolutionize the light sources uh, with all microsurgery. And uh, Siler is the first one to come out with it, and we're very proud. Um, this, we literally just got uh, the first one in uh, today, and uh, we're going through uh, all the UL and FDA uh, certifications at this point, and, uh, but it will be on the market in about two months. Um, one of the first things I wanted to show you was we have two microscopes, uh, one with our metal halide light source, which is a fantastic light source. It lasts for about 2,000 hours. Uh, it's a 50-watt metal halide. It's the brightest standard light source in the market with about 115,000 lux. And um, what we have then as well is we have the new plasma. Um, the metal halide, fantastic light source, like I said, but it does have some disadvantages as well, which has, for me, I think a little bluer tint when you're taking any kind of digital photography or HD video. And uh, with the new plasma, it absolutely dominates metal halide, LED. LED, the nice thing with LED, of course, is the longevity. But when you get to the higher magnification, it becomes a little darker. Like I said, we are going to offer the LED, uh, but the plasma is what we're really excited about. Uh, but right now, we have two cam cannons, uh, DSLRs, uh, hooked up to our surgical scopes. And we have many DVI into HDMI on uh, the 40-inch Dynex. And uh, you get this, you get fantastic imaging. Like I said, what you like to do is have uh, a nice DSLR, uh, either a Nikon D7000, a Canon EOS Rebel, or even the Sony NEX5s. All three are fantastic cameras. We recommend all three. We have specific adapters here at Siler, which can, of course, adapt any camera under the sun to the scope. But uh, we found those three have been uh, really nice uh, for our end users. As you see right now, this is the metal halide light source. And uh, we're using a Canon EOS Rebel Mini DVI to HDMI. Uh, gives you that 1080p CMOS. As you can see, you get fantastic uh, resolution, okay, and color. There's no doubt about it. However, what I want to show you is the big difference between a metal halide light source and our new plasma light source. So, let's switch it. Switch to HDMI. One, all you got to do, and then we'll put the live video. Now, as you can see, the difference in the lighting, uh, it's a much pure, wider light. Uh, it's the only light out there that is even close to a xenon light source, uh, but offers the longevity of almost an LED. Um, as you can see, the whiteness, the crispness, uh, it brings out digital photography to the best possible resolution and coloring that a digital camera can possibly take. Uh, we've taken the LED and we've put it up against uh, the 
the plasmas and the metal halides and uh, the halogens, and there is no doubt uh, the plasma is the light source of the future. And uh, like I said, we will be having this to the public within about two months. We're going through the proper certification uh, process right now, but uh, please call us uh, or get online right now because I'll be answering any questions that you may have on the plasma light source. So thank you very much and uh, look forward to speaking with you.